le Canada. Je peux vous dire qu'après le vote du public, vous avez reçu... Quarante-cinq points. Next, it's the turn of the United States. After the public vote, you have received... Nineteen points. Nous continuons avec la France. Le public vous a attribué... 44 points. Germany. The audience voting at home have awarded you... 21 points. Passons à l'Irlande. Tous ceux qui regardent à la maison vous ont attribué... 20 points. Onwards to Poland. Everyone watching at home have awarded you... 72 points, and you're now in the lead! La Norvège, le public vous a donné... 59 points. Right, it is getting very tense, and here we only have five countries left to announce. But, do bear in mind, the leaderboard could still all change. Il reste cinq pays qui n'ont pas encore reçu leur point du public. Mais rappelez-vous que tout peut changer. Belgium, you're up next. After the audience vote, you received... 61 points, and Belgium is now in first position. Le prochain pays à recevoir ses points du public est l'Italie. Et elle a reçu... 87 points. L'Italie est désormais en première place. I can tell you, this competition began with 12 countries all vying for the top place. Now, only the current leader and the three acts yet to receive their scores could still win. So then, let's check it out. Italy is currently in first place with 163 points. But, will they stay there? We have three countries yet to receive their points. Luxembourg, Netherlands and the United Kingdom. Which one of them will claim the top spot? Le gagnant peut être le leader actuel ou l'un des trois pays qui n'a pas encore reçu ses points du public. Okay, next to receive their points is the United Kingdom. The audience vote have awarded you 112 points. The United Kingdom is now in the lead. So, with the United Kingdom in the lead and Luxembourg and Netherlands yet to receive their scores, one of those three will be the winner of the Eurovision Smut Contest 2024. Oh, very soon we will hand over the new Eurovision trophy to the new winner. C'est maintenant au tour des Pays-Bas. Et les Pays-Bas ont reçu... 58 points All right then, the tension is in the room, but there's only one country left. The United Kingdom is currently in first place, but hang on, because Luxembourg has yet to receive their score from the public. So it could still take it from them. Il ne reste plus qu'un pays. 
Le Royaume-Uni est actuellement en tête, mais le Luxembourg n'a pas encore reçu ses points du public. All right, United Kingdom, Luxembourg, are you ready? Because one of you will be tonight's winner. And now I can tell you that Luxembourg need a minimum of 106 points to win. Le Luxembourg a besoin de 106 points au minimum pour gagner. Okay, here we go. Luxembourg, the public, has given you 99 points. Well, there you go. We have a winner, the United Kingdom. You have won the Eurovision Sport Contest 2024. Congratulations. Félicitations au Royaume-Uni qui remporte cette troisième édition de l'Eurovision Sport Contest. This has been the most extraordinary evening and what a result. Congratulations to Harry for the United Kingdom. They're off to get ready to perform again. Félicitations à Harry 